Hello again and welcome back to Super Mario World. So now we're in Forest of Illusion. After taking care of Ludwig Koopa, we're here. So we're going to continue on with this next world. And from the looks of this, I'm pretty sure this is going to be a very tricky level because there's going to be numerous location and direction to take. So we're going to be going to every secret we can find to get out of this forest. So let's get into this. And before we do, be sure to leave a like and a subscribe. So with that out of the way, let's begin our journey into this area. And we got ourselves some wigglers, these worms, caterpillar or whatever they are. And I already lost Yoshi. Now let's try to do this again without messing up. Okay. Let me switch this. And of course I can skip this level by pressing the select. Got myself some Goombas. I was gonna get the pink apple. And there are a lot of one-ups around here. And already some of you may not know, but if you step on one of those wigglers, they get very mad and try to attack you. You can tell by turning seeing them turn in red. Like that. And they follow you. That's for them because, well, thanks to my action, I already lost my super cape. And there's this. There's the secret over there I was trying to say. Let me see if I can try to get over there without getting hit with the shell. I'm just gonna skip it when I finish up. Let's just get through this in one piece. Now we've completed the first level, we're going to the next. But before we do that, let's just continue on with this again. And this time we're going to that secret area, just to get that keyhole right over there. Already got that. It looks like I'm gonna have to abandon Yoshi because one of the items there is can help you get through some areas that you can't reach. I'll just show it to you real soon. Oh, there it is. Just let me get over here. And you get the power balloon. This helps you get through area. You turn into a balloon. And you float for a few seconds. Just gonna have to wait for this guy to get out. And I got the key, so let's just wait until I lose my power. And we got it. Time to go to the secret area. So basically there are different locations to go here and there. Alright, let me just go to the for the first ghost house here. I'll just continue on to the main one real soon. And this area seems pretty small. And that's fine, let me just get through this. Almost there. Of course I don't have my feather. At least not yet. There it is. 
me just check what's all the way here. In this door. I'm just ignoring that because I already got the flower. And the feather. It's not that important. I'm just trying to dodge all these ghosts without getting touched. And probably there's a secret. There it is. And I made it. Let's just get out of here. Get that coin. And I made it safe. On to the next. I'm not trying to play fishing this guy again. Let me try to take care of him. Oh, I was gonna jack his clouds, but unfortunately I hit him. Oh well, I'll find another one. There he is. Things never change with these guys. Secret room. Pipe area. Nope. You gone. I don't need this. Because I found another secret. So like they say in the last video, you have to use your wits because there are a lot of hidden areas here and there and already I found another secret and this I remember is a pretty difficult one this platform goes real fast well not fast but you just have to take time to get over there and I can tell because the background is moving kind of fast kind of feels nauseous whenever I look at it, but I don't think it's going to bother me that much. We'll just get through it. And I messed up. Hopefully I can get through this without my power. Also, there's a secret block area, blue, if you find it in the forest of illusion. And that's fine. So we're out of the secret area, so now we're heading to the small fortress. I mean, the first one in this woods. Hopefully we're gonna take care of the same boss, the Triceratops. I'm gonna pronounce that their names wrong. And watch out for those boss buzzsaw things. Dodging the best I can while trying to dodge these things trying to smash me. Trying to take my time to get through this. Kind of looks like sponge. These things are made of sponges or loofahs. All right, more of these buzz saws. I think they're called grinders. Made it. Jeez. 
here and there. Ooh, that was a close one. <laughs> I thought they were gonna get me for sure. At least I got my feather power. And there's the door. Let's just take care of these four. Mind if I get a lift? These Reznor. Reznor. And there's something you don't see every day. You find yourself a star road. Now this little area will take you to a location up in the star area. Right here, so this will take you to a star world. But fortunately, we're just gonna have to come back some other time. Get back to the Halls of Ugh, sorry. Halls of Illusion. Forest of Illusion to continue our journey. So let's go to here again, the first one. And let's just continue with the main road. And I should have just done that. I just could have just get that cloud for myself again. Oh well, so let's just move on. <laughs> Almost there. I'm skipping you. Yeah, I'm just trying to avoid that for now. take a ride on the cloud. I was trying to say that once you hit those guys, you can ride on the cloud for a short time. It's not that spectacular, but it gets you high places without going through any obstacle. Just like that. this world, so land, whatever. So let's just move on to the next main world. Not world level. I'm getting that messed up again. <laughs> Alright. Trying to dodge these these things. Sea urchins. I just don't want to turn into an icicle, a freeze, or whatever. Probably I'm mistaking that with... Uh, mistaking that with the cartoon. I just got one of them. So, let's move on. It's pretty quick if I just grab this. Mushroom again. Alright, let me see what this gets me. And I gotta watch out for these fishes because the ones that are sleeping, if you pass right through them, they'll just chase you. Like right now. One of them is chasing me now. Luckily, they can just fall back to sleep. Mm -hmm. Let me see. 
see if there's a secret. No, no, they're not, so. This is a dead end. Trying to avoid these guys best I can. And I got my health taken away. Way too many fishes here and there. Time is running out. If I had Yoshi, this would be a lot faster. If you go through here, however, there's a secret passage. Makes you look like it's a dead end, but not likely, and it's not. And what do you know? I got the area cleared. So now we're in our third palace, the blue switch, so let's try to turn on that thing and try to get these coins as much as I can. Alright, almost there. spinies. They turn into coins. Pretty neat. And we found ourselves the blue switch. Boom. That's done, so now let's get back to the previous level. Wait, how did I go fast? Whatever. I got my fireball power, so let's take care of these guys. That was a close one. And of course I can't hit these guys. I almost choked. I think they're called Rest Van, Rip Van Fishy, I don't know, something like that. And I got a lot of fish chasing me, but not anymore. We've made it to the area, and we're almost clearing off some of the forest. So let's see where this takes me. Most of these enemies are covered in bubbles. Unless if I touch them, they'll get out of here. Or they pop, or whatever. And look, I got my friend Yoshi back. Let's see, I got a secret bonus. I don't have time for that, so let's just ignore that. Yoshi, come back! Oh, I lost it. But somehow I got it back. At least. I'm really not good at this. Try that again. And this time I'm not gonna pay any attention to those guys. Wow. 
And I lost Yoshi. That's fine, I'll just come back when I complete the level. There it is. Let me check if there's any secret entrance. Oh, there is. And I got the key. Already we've completed that part. But we're not gonna go through that area just yet. Let's just go here one more time to see if we can find another secret zone. Just dodge this area. I mean, it's pretty strange. I got some mushrooms. Reference to all the toads giving me the mushroom power. In fact, I don't even know why Toad from the previous game couldn't come back. Probably needs to um, stay in the Mushroom Kingdom just to keep an eye on things while we were away. That's fine. There we go. And looks like the area is already cleared out. Completing the entire forest of illusion zone. So let's get out of here and take care of our next Koopaling. Roy's castle. All right, so let's see what Roy's up to. And it's one of these snake path level, at least this part. I almost fall off. I forget what that's, that game is called, which features a snake and you have to follow it. Not Battletoads, I already know that. It's something different, I don't know. This fire thing is bouncy. <laughs> that was a close one. Now we're entering to the spike zone. I'm almost there. I'm gonna have to take this box thing. More of these Bowser statue. And looks like one of these things in the same part. I don't know why. Whatever, we finally made it to Roy's. And as you can see, it's the same fight from the previous one. I've got Morton. It's pretty simple, just hit him hit numerous time, but the walls moves closer. Ooh, that was a close one. That was pretty new anyway. And he's dead. Another egg safe. And this doesn't seem to work, so what's going on? Oh. Alright, Mario finds his way through the Forest of Illusion and has an egg end to Roy's Cap Koopa of Castle 5. Onward to Castle... F Ugh, I can't read. Onward to the dangerous but tastiest chocolate island. I got lost in the sentence. But from this level, Chocolate Island seems like a pretty tasty place. And looks like that's gonna have to take care of the 
forest part. So I'm going to end the video there. So thank you for watching this. If there's anything that you like, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll try better to fix my stutterness because I'm doing it right now. So until then, I will see you again in the next video.